Welcome to the Rusted Garden Homestead. In today's two minute tip video, I'm gonna show you how to prune your tomato plant to be a double stem tomato. You're gonna to have basically two production stems and I'll explain to you what that means. I will also include in the video description the two minute tip videos I did on why you bottom prune and how do you identify suckers, because that's important too. So this is a red beef steak. It's getting pretty tall. I don't know, I'm terrible with measurement, but maybe three feet tall. I was putting in the steak today and decided I want to prune this to two main stems. And the main stems are gonna be this one and the one over here. But let me show you how you figure that out. And then I'll show you what I remove. You take a look in here. It's hard to see because I let this overgrow too much. But you have the main stem right where my thumb is and that's going straight up. That's gonna be the main stem. And as it goes up, a leaf comes out, suckers come out, production stems come out and they just keep growing out of the joints where the leaf meets the main stem and your tomato will get out of control. So this is what we're gonna end up with when we're done. Just the main stem, we keep going to the left and then we keep one sucker or production stem over to the right. So we're taking this from really eight, maybe 10 production stems, which means is a tomato plant just keeps putting out suckers in the joints. They flower, they produce fruit, the nose stems put out more suckers and it just gets bigger and bigger and bigger. So what we're doing is we're removing many of the production stems and just keeping it two. One, two, and that's how we control now, the size. that's really confusing. So the first thing I'm gonna do is remove some of these leaves and I'll talk to you about how we get this down to two production stems and what we remove to keep it that way. We're gonna do that because I don't want this tomato to get really big and bushy. I just wanna put the two stems right up this post and I'll get plenty of tomatoes. Here are a bunch of leaves I took out from the bottom and I like to have a 12 inch gap from the soil to the bottom leaves as this tomato grows over time. I increase the gap from soil to leaves. So here is the main stem that I was trying to show you and this is why you prune because this plant was starting to get out of control. So everywhere where a leaf came out, a sucker came out which turns into a production stem. It will flower, it will grow fruit. I'm going to cut those off and again, I know it looks drastic. One, two, this is a really big one, three. And then this one too. Four. We are taking this from a single stem to a double stem. I took off all of these suckers, which are turning into production stems, and you can see flowers grow on those. And it's fine if you wanna let this go, that's okay. But in this area, I just want two stems coming up here. Now let me show you how you identify the second stem. Now it's starting to take shape and this looks pretty drastic. So your plant could go into a little shock. It's unlikely when you let it get this big it should be okay. But just following my finger, that is the original main stem going all the way up. And you can see all these places where I cut off things. Main stem goes straight up here, goes over this way, and it would continue to grow. You see that it flowers, produces tomatoes, continues to go, flowers again, and I will just take the stem all the way up. That would be a single stem if you wanted to prune everything else away. But in this case, right here where you come up, that's the main stem going left, a sucker turned into a production stem. And you can see that it flowered, produced fruit here, and it continues to grow. And I'm gonna keep these two stems, one, two. That's double stem pruning coming straight from here, V's out, and I will just tie these up here like this, going all the way up. So that leaves me with this production stem, one over here, where is it, right up in there. You can see that. And another one right there. They all have to come off because I'm keeping this as two main production stems. And that's all the pruning I'm gonna to do today. I mean, I've really taken a lot off this tomato plant. And you can see that it has the V shape. Now there's other suckers that are turning into production stems like right here. I will remove those over time. But right now I have tomatoes here, tomatoes here, tomatoes here, more flowers, flowers up there flowers off the second production stem. That's gonna be plenty of tomatoes and that's how you go from a single stem to a double stem. 
I will continue to take care of this plant as a double stem, tie them up right along this post, and I'll get plenty of tomatoes. Hope that was somewhat easy to understand. It is a little bit confusing. Maybe watch it a second time. And I tried to make this two minutes, but you know, I think it was worth the longer explanation. Thanks so much for watching. Please, Please check out my seed shop at therustedgarden.com. And we go from single stem up this way, keeping the second stem for double stem pruning. Thanks for watching.